commentator, El Gentonio. El Gentonio here on commentary for episode 19 of Anthony's Open Challenge. Anthony Three Belts making his way to the Trampa Ring. Who's his opponent going to be tonight? We were going to have to wait and see. Joe Anthony nearing a record. He's held that Intercontinental Championship for nearly a year. Right there you see the JTW World Heavyweight, the JTW Intercontinental and the YouTube Promo Champion. Something seems to be on his mind tonight. Giant and he's slowly making his way to the ring, putting his championship titles down on the floor. Maybe he's only going to challenge for the Intercontinental Championship tonight. Maybe not going to give his opponent the choice. Anthony signaling for a microphone. What's he got to say here tonight? Has been playing on my mind for a very long time now. I'm running out of challenges. I'm carrying three championships at once. After I'm done with kick clips, that will be four. Now I don't know about you guys, but in the wrestling industry, you might think that someone with a load of championships is someone worthwhile, someone to beat, but in my eyes, it's just a bigger target. Now well, normally I'm down for a fight 24-7, but there's other people on this show. I've got a whole roster of guys back there. I think I've proven my worth over time. I think I've proven that none of them can beat me. Well, none of them can beat me twice anyway. So, it's with a heavy heart that I make this next decision. Oh no, Anthony, what are you going to say? One thing clear. Anthony's open challenge is still open. I'm still your JTW World Heavyweight Champion. However, I would like to ask my partner, my best friend, Zach Rowe, to come down to the trampoline ring right now. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I am just as confused as you are. I'm sure Zach is very confused as well. What is John Daddy doing here tonight? He's calling Zach down to the ring. It, it, surely these two don't want to fight. These two are friends. Zach looks very confused as well. This cannot be good. Giant and he doesn't seem himself. He seems like he's got something bothering him. Zach making his way onto the trampa ring. I'm gonna disappear off commentary. Let's see what these two have to say to each other. Probably wondering why I've called you out here, mate. Yeah. You're confused. Yeah. yeah, I am. I am. Ladies and gentlemen. This following match is for the JTW Intercontinental Championship. Referee, ring that bell. Well, you heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. We got Giant Anthony versus Zach Rowe. Another match in their iconic rivalry. Giant Anthony going to defend his Intercontinental Championship against Zach Rowe right here tonight. Wait, 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 wait. What is he doing? Giant Anthony, what are you doing? He's laid down for Zach Rowe. No, what are you doing? One, two, three. We have a new JTW Intercontinental Champion, Zach Rowe. Joe Anthony just voluntarily gave the Intercontinental Championship to his best friend. What the hell? What is going on? Anthony raising Zach Rowe's arm. We have a new Intercontinental Championship. The historic reign of Joe Anthony has ended. Zach Rowe is your new JTW Intercontinental Champion. Thank you for watching, ladies and gents. You, you didn't need to do that. You just didn't. I mean, I mean, I'm grateful, but you didn't need to. Don't get me wrong. You've been into Continental Champ before. You know the weight it carries. Mm. You're my mid card now. You're the guy that's behind me the whole way. I need you to have my back the same way I'll have yours. Always. Hundred percent. 
I mean, I was just as clueless and as confused as everyone else out there was when you called me out. And when I heard you say ring that bell, I thought we was about to have the match of all matches. And when you just laid down and let me go for the pin, so much was going through my head. And mainly the fact that I know that a lot of you want this. I know for a fact that I have been having my eye on this. I have been thinking about it a lot, reminiscing what it was like being Intercontinental Champ. It does carry a lot of weight. You do have to defend it. When you have this title around your shoulder, there's a different era about you. There's a different era about this place. But like I say, I will be defending this at every given shot. I will take on whoever wants a shot at this because I know for a fact that I have what it takes to put every single member of the JTW roster down. Confidently. I am not champion for no reason. I wasn't champion for no reason before. I am not the person that's done everything there is to do on JTW for no reason. I am Zach Rowe and I am the JTW Intercontinental Champion and I plan for it to stay that way for a long time. Now let me get one thing straight, a lot of you are going to be confused, a lot of you, a few of you may even be angry. There's been great thought behind this for a long time. I've been thinking to myself, you know what, as much as I adore doing the open challenge, the stress, everything that comes over me from holding two championships is a hard fought. It's just, an, it's a nightmare. And I have been Intercontinental Champion of JTW for over 346 days. I beat Bad B for that championship in October of 2018. That was a different Joe Anthony. A lot has changed since then. Now initially, a lot of you guys may be wondering, I thought you were challenging Kit Clips and putting your championships on the line. Kit made it very clear what he wants and it isn't the JTW World Heavyweight and it isn't the JTW Intercontinental. Kit Clips wants my promo championship, so that will be on the line. Which meant I could plan ahead. A new series is coming to the Joe Talks Wrestling YouTube channel, ladies and gentlemen, and it is called the Zach Rowe Open Challenge, running alongside Anthony's Open Challenge. Be expecting a lot in the near future. Be expecting Joe Anthony and Zach Rowe to be running JTW for a long time. <laughs>